What's up? Uh, I'm back with another video. I, I move this stuff real fast. Uh, back with another video. Uh, this is gonna be about. Well, first of all, uh, no one's actually like. Uh, everybody's sending me a bunch of comments about how to pull forward, and I don't get this. Well, I'm gonna make a a later version. So first thing you want to do, you want to get start. Type in run. Well, just type in CMD. Or if you're on XP, just type in uh, run and then type in CMD in there. And now you want to type in IP config enter. And I don't really care if you guys see my IPv4 address. Well, that's what you're going to need right there. Don't write it down or just minimize it then you want to open a new internet once you open your internet go back to here and you're going to need right there okay that was like complete lag but right your uh, default gateway right there uh, so it's 192.168.1.1 let me okay, get all that I don't know what's lagging and you just type it right here uh, 194 I think it was dot 164 let me look at it real fast 928 I think this was just pretty much type it like that. I was gonna do it this way. Whoops. Don't really care. Go to copy that, go up here. I'm just doing this, just type in what it says, but I'm just I don't feel like retyping all in, so and this is for a Netgear router. Okay, don't do it then. Let me minimize this. I am like, I haven't really had much sleep. Two. Dot one six eight. Dot one point one. And it, this thing right here should pop up. And what you want to do? Let me excel this. Okay, never mind. Well, what you want to do is it's going to ask for a username and password. Your username, if your parents haven't changed it or anything like that. What you want to do? You want to type in admin. Go down here and type in password. Hit OK, and it will bring you to your Netgear router options you want to go down to port forwarding and triggering right there and you can see I got minecraft servers and then you want to hit uh, add customized server and then you just type in your IPv4 right there and wherever you have like a uh, <laughs> wherever you're trying to port forward sorry message uh wherever you're trying to port forward like uh, a server like minecraft it you're gonna have to go to a notepad and it should be in there once you download it uh, or well, whatever you're trying to download and what you do is you type in the IP that is your IPv4 address right here that you typed into Netgear router options right here so you pretty much put a name for it uh, I'll put this well, I'm just minecraft you want to leave it as that enter point like uh, 25565 to whoops 
two, five, five, six, five. Or like if you're playing uh, Counter Strike, Counter Strike Source, you're and you want to make your own server. This is pretty much what you do, but it it's more complicated than this. This is like the port forward part, and then you just type in your IPv4 address and just let you guys know my IPv4 changes like every four hours so and if it don't work then you might want to put in a new one you just hit apply okay use other Okay. Alright, I'm just gonna go like that and then apply. Okay, I don't know what's wrong, but I know that's how you do it. Let's try to go in here again. See? Right there. You know, you just type it in. Black screen. Uh. I customize server. I'll put in hi. Uh, two five five six five maybe. Uh, tab 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 seven, and then you hit apply. But for some reason it's not letting me. I think I have too many on here. I'm not sure. Whoops. <laughs> this is a good way to start a video, ain't it? So pretty much what you do is you go there, seven, apply, and voila. I think it was because I have too many on there. I'm not sure. But, yeah. And if you want to run more than two servers off of this, the only thing you have to do is uh, just make another one, just like this. Like uh, this. But a different port, like this, like uh, two five five six six two five five six six. But this one right here is two five five six five two five five six five. And as you can see, the ports, well, the addresses are different. But if you want to run two, just change both these to seven. Well, whatever your IPv4 address is, just change them to that. And all you have to do is type in a different port and it will connect to either server so that's about it I really don't want to click on this but I have to and so I'll catch you guys later comment rate subscribe uh, do all that because <coughs> I want you to and just don't do it for me do it for the world yep alright I'll see you guys later bye